A third Varnam we have in Todi, that is on Goddess again. And it is Todi without Panchamam. But unless we specify that it doesn't have Panchamam, nobody messes the Panchamam because it sounds like pure Todi. And of course, I can talk about each Varnam for half an hour. I'll just give you some salient features. And in this Varnam, the Charanam, Ni Garimagani, because of your Karunyam, Ni Darini Cheritini Sada, I come to your door always. Chama Nigama Modini. And it is full of Swarakshrams. Swarakshrams are when the note and the syllable in the literature are the same. So, Ni Garimagani becomes Ni Garimagani. Ni darini jeriti ni sada sama ni gama modini. This is the charanam. And one swaram has sahityam. Kama mada damani gadadhari. It becomes Kama mada damani gadadhari. Like this is part of Todi Varnam. Then we have one in Ramapriya, which is a very simple and beautiful one of his earliest compositions. And one in Karaharapriya, which is on Lord Ganesha. Each set of swarams in the Charanam talks about one story in the life of Ganesha. So there, there is a temple near Trichy where on the walls of the temple some obscure stories of Lord Ganesha are inscribed. And one of them says that three asuras who came in the form of a tree, a net and a human being. Vriksha rupa, vala rupa, nara rupu layunna, nisha charula muvuranu. Ganapati came in the form of a bird, pakshi rupi vai varala vadhinchi. He killed them, e kshitiki shanti subhiksha mosagina sumukha pavana. So this, even the melody is very very beautiful. Mm Vriksha Rupa Vala Rupa Nara Rupu Layun Nisha Charula Movaranu Pakshi Rupi Vai Varala Vadhinchi Ikshiti Kishanti Subhiksha Mosagina Sumukha Pavana And there is another story about an Asura called Durasara and how Ganesha destroyed him when he attacked Varanasi with bad intentions. So, how Guruji puts it? Varanasi nakraminchina durasaruni durasa nirasa gavimpa. So, he converted his bad intention to disappointment. So, like that, these are all very, very beautiful compositions, and it is a long overdue thing that these are getting recorded. And I hope music lovers will, music lovers, musicians, music students, will learn them, appreciate them and sing them in concerts. And it's my privilege and we have a great master, Hari Kumar on the Mridangam. And we hope we'll do justice to the great compositions and the great composer himself.